Welcome to Electra Online. In this series of videos, the next playlist, we're going to talk about what we call constructions. Now, constructions are is the word used to construct things in geometry. Line segments, angles, parallel lines, things such as that. And yes, the tricks of the trade to do that are kind of a lost art in lots of places, especially now with computers, makes it so easy to make things. But we should still learn how it's done with a piece of paper and a compass and a pen. Now, for a compass, we're simply going to use a string here because I don't have any compass large enough to use on the board. But you'll see in just a moment how this works just as well. And you could actually use that on a piece of paper as well. All you need is a string with a little loop to it so you can put your pen in it. And then you can make arc arcs with this particular device. So let's go ahead and start with the first one. We're going to learn how to construct a line segment. So here we have a line segment from A to B and we we'll want to draw another line segment that is congruent, meaning it has the exact same length. So what we're going to do here is we're going to put our pen through this little, little opening right here. And what I do is I put my pen right up point B. I want to make sure I keep it on there. And I put the end of the string right up point A. So now I have the exact length right here. So if I draw a line going this way, like so, I can come over here, go to point C, and draw the exact same little arc, like that. And where those two lines cross, of course, that represents the exact same length. I can now draw a point right here, called point D, and I can then say that line segment AB is congruent to line segment CD by this method. And that's how we construct a line segment from another other line segment, making sure that's the exact same length. So normally you would use a compass, but of course my compass is big enough, so I use a string, go like this, draw the line there, draw the line there, and then you have an exact congruent line segment, and that's how we construct a line segment.